Breaking news from Pembroke High School. Dr. Smith is here to give us the facts on how dangerous e-cigarettes are. Yes, you're right. E-cigs are a big problem this age. They are advertised as safer than traditional cigarettes, but we don't believe they are actually safe. E-cigs are a gateway to drug and cigarette abuse. Most e-cigs promote nicotine addiction. Wait, how do e-cigarettes work? There are three types, Egos, Sigalikes, and Modular e-cigarettes, or MODs. For example, Egos are the largest type. They can be refilled with varying amounts of nicotine and other chemicals. The danger of e-cigs have not been 100% studied, but we do know that vapor contains toxins that are found in traditional cigarette smoke and air pollution. These harmful chemicals absorb in the body and damage cells and the immune system. That's crazy. Now live from Pembroke High School is our news reporter Kaylee. What's going on there, Kaylee? Good morning. Kaylee Ryan here at PHS. We have news of e-cig use in the bathroom. E-cig use has become a huge epidemic at PHS. Kids just think it's a good alternative to cigarettes, but in reality they wouldn't even be using it in the first place. And I think I saw some kids outside in the bathroom using them. Let's go check it out. Hey, uh, what rooms are you at, bro? 0.6, bro. I just got this new atomizer. It's actually pretty sick. Jesus, dude, you're out of your mind. That's, <laughs> that's, that's too much nicotine, man. Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me? I was at 12 the other day. We're good. Oh my god. You should have some at 6 right now. No, I think you're good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll catch up with you. Ah, yeah, see you later. Right. Right. What's, uh, what's going on in here? Yeah, uh, we were just, well, just uh, uh, we were just hanging out. Yeah, what the uh, smells in here? Uh, I just got the new cologne. Yeah, that's my bad. Oh, did you? Yeah. Was it called e-cig? E-cig. No. Uh, propanol, glycol, and nicotine. Yeah, but that's three compared to fifteen hundred in a cigarette, or seven thousand in a cigarette. You know what I mean? Well, propanol, gly uh, glycol is. <laughs> Pretty much the equivalent of antifreeze, you know. Really? Yeah, you really want to be inhaling that stuff, putting that in your body? No. It says take. Oh, keep going. What? Those, on. those it's that it's use e-cigs get compromised immune systems too. Can't fight off the flu, right, pneumonia. Sure. I, I, I had an e-cig. I mean, Rick, so I had an e-cig. I was vaping. So you did. It. Yeah. You did. Yeah. I can't tell you how disappointed I am in you, man. Yeah. I know. Someone who takes care of themselves the way you do. I know. What about you? I was doing the same thing. I was hitting his. And what are we doing moving forward? I, uh, I mean, obviously graduation's around the corner. I don't want to get in any trouble. I mean, is there anything we can do? I, if I quit E6, you know, give it to you, like, can we do something about it? It's not so much about graduation and you getting in trouble. It's about what this will do to your body. It's true. I, I really didn't think about it. Didn't know it was that bad. Is it, it really antifreeze? It's an antifreeze? Yeah, yeah. And we can go outside in the parking lot and just down some antifreeze instead of hanging out in the bathroom. I mean, why not do that? Yeah. Um, so what are we going to do? 